Media Composer 6.5 brings together a powerful suite of audio tools that both enhance audio editing tasks and simplify some common audio workflows. A number of enhancements have been made that make it easier than ever to edit audio keyframes. You can easily copy and paste keyframe automation within the same audio clip or to adjacent audio clips. If you trim a clip and later pull that clip back out, the automation data remains intact. Media Composer 6.5 gives you the option of removing any hidden automation. With the addition of a few key commands, you can now select a single keyframe or a range of keyframes, and using one of the commands, you can move the keyframes left or right in one frame increments. Now to adjust the volume, you can hold a key command and move the keyframes up or down in 1 dB increments. This makes it easier to adjust keyframe volume automation in a simple and predictable manner. Now working with surround audio is essential in many film and TV workflows, and current versions of Media Composer include integrated surround panning, making it easy to place your elements into the surround field. Working with surround tracks can quickly raise your audio voice count, so Media Composer 6.5 provides 64 audio voices to help with those demanding surround projects. Monitoring in surround requires that you have multiple speakers set up. For instance, a 5.1 project means six speakers. Now, for many video editors, that's simply not practical, and that's why current versions of Media Composer provide for integrated down mixing. You can work with a stereo, a 5.1, or even a 7.1 project and output to multiple speakers, or have Media Composer provide real-time down mixing so you can monitor in stereo, yet still hear all of those surround elements. Current versions of Media Composer support real-time audio suite plugins, and included with Media Composer are a suite of professional RTAS plugins like EQs, compressors, limiters, and reverbs making it easy for you to shape the sound that you want. If your workflow is to hand off to an audio editor using Pro Tools, then you'll find that the AAF exchange between Media Composer 6.5 and Pro Tools 10 is extremely robust. Any audio volume information like clip gain, automation, or pan information, including any surround panning, can be included in the AAF export. Any RTAS plugins and the plugin settings can also be included in the AAF export. When Pro Tools opens the AAF, you'll have a pre-built Pro Tools session with all the audio in place, with volume, pan, and plugins ready to go. So the audio editor is starting where the video editor leaves off. The audio tools in Media Composer 6.5 are both powerful, flexible, and easier than ever to use. If you want to try out some of these features for yourself, download the trial version of Media Composer at avid.com forward slash Media Composer.